Alright everybody, welcome yourself back to another episode of my Pokemon Heart Gold Ultimate Randomizer Nuzlocke. Now people, in the last episode we came here to Mahogany Town, right like at the last second. And um, in today's episode hopefully we can take down the next gym, I know we do have some stuff in between. But for the most part hopefully we will be able to do that, so before we continue on I may as well give a little overview of the team just in case you missed the last episode. I'm not gonna go over, actually, whatever, I'm just gonna go over everything. So first off, we got Gry here, I'm not gonna say the full name because I don't know how to pronounce it. Level 36, pure bug type with the moves Bubble, Tail Glow, Lick and Roar of Time. Then we got Mr. Krabs the Kingler, level 35, Ghost Water type with Astonish, Shockwave, Shadow Punch, and Surf. Next up we got Dash the Dawn Fan, Fighting Poison type with Poison Tail, Assurance, Spatial Rend, and Rolling Kick. Next up we got Egghead the Pikachu, level 35, normal psychic type, with Muddy Water, Steel Wing, Discharges, and Zen Headbutt. Then we got Dylan the Typhlosion, pure normal type with Dizzy Punch, Stone Edge, Needle Arm, and Steel Wing, level 36. And last but not least, we got Luke, that's how you say it, uh, Heracross, Luke the Heracross, level, yeah, level 37, uh, an electric poison type with Cut, Worry Seed, Focus Blast, and, Focus Blast, Focus Blast, and Shatter. Real quick though, be sure to answer the question- oh my god. <laughs> Be sure to answer the question of the day, as well as drop a like. Your support is greatly appreciated now. If I'm not mistaken, I think we gotta go in here, maybe? I don't- I don't remember. Hi there. Huh? You're windblowing in this room? Okay, okay, why don't you buy something? Uh... I don't know, man. Let's see if we got anything to sell, though. Um... Nope. Oh well, I guess. Oh well, I don't necessarily remember what we're supposed to do here, but at the moment, I'm guessing we just- Okay, whatever. I'm guessing we just continue on, like, whatever. I know you're gonna stop me, yep. Okay, da, da, da. Sure, let's get a Rage Candy Bar. What do we got in here, though? Hi there? Okay... What do you gotta say? Wait, 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 I think- I don't remember if we gotta turn on the little radio or not. Uh, let's try, I guess. Nice. Nice. Alright, let's talk to this dude right here. What do you gotta say, man? See this guy with the black cape? He's been going back and forth. Okay, so I'm assuming we have to go to the... the Lake of Rage then. Do we go this way? I don't know, man. I have zero idea. Nice? There we go, we're fixed. See ya, ha ha ha, okay. Oh yeah, yeah, we- oh, nice, nice and glitched. Hold it right- hold it there, kiddo. The toll is- oh, okay, thank you very much. Wait, hold up. Oh my god, really? I did not mean to do that. Ah, oh, hold up, hold up. No, not save. Dang it. I hate when he glitches like that. Alright, let's just go through and hope it stops glitching. There we go. Alright, what do we got here? We got an oval stone, that's okay. Let's bust out the repels though, because I know I'm going to regret it if I don't. Alright. I don't remember- oh. I kind of sort of accidentally dodged you. I think I might do the same with you, okay. Wow, we're already here, nice. Wait, do I have Pokeballs? Yes I do, I have a decent amount, okay, so we might be okay. The Gyarados are angry, it's a bad omen! Do, do we just gotta go talk to the Gyarados, I guess? Demise deceive me, okay. Now the thing is, is this is still gonna be a red Gyarados, and if not, is it just gonna be another random Pokemon? And is if if so, is that Pokemon gonna be shiny? Let's see, I guess. Actually, let's let's save just in case. Not options, save. There we go. All right, hi there. That was. What was that? Really? Oh, it's shiny though. Nice. Okay, I didn't think it would be shiny. That's cool. You know, I- I really did not expect it to be shiny. Like, I was- I was- I was like, is it gonna be shiny or not? Cause I don't know really how the game works. Oh, we're kinda trapped in here. Got a nice paralysis off there, let's just keep going for that. Oh. Oh my god, just- yeah, 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 just- just keep doing that, why don't you? Whatever. You shouldn't be all too difficult to catch, to be perfectly honest, like... You're not like a high-level Pokemon or whatever. Oh, we need to be careful. All right, let's, let's let's hope we can catch you now. Yes, there we go. So now we have our um, 
A Roselia here that is a shiny, pure fire type. That's that's a bit of an odd one. Alright, give a nickname. Hold up, let me pull up my little nickname list I got going on. Forgot to pull it up as always. Where is it? There it is. Oh dang it. I hold up. What? What did I do? Did I accidentally get rid of it? Oh wait, I think I might have. Whoops! Shoots! I'm just gonna name it Rosie, I guess. Cause I'm unoriginal like that. Rosie. Dang it, I- I'm dumb and I should have checked that beforehand. But that's cool though, the fact that we have a shiny Pokemon. Like, I was afraid it was just gonna be some normal Pokemon, whatever, and wasn't gonna be anything cool, but no. Turned out to be a shiny Roselia. Eh. Could've been anything else, but still. Shiny is a shiny. That red Gyarados wasn't acting right. As I feared, somebody must- somebody must have forced it to evolve. Did you come here because of the wild tales? You're Luna. I'm Lance, a trainer like you. I heard some rumbling, so I came to investigate. I saw the way you battled earlier, Luna. I can tell you're a trainer with considerable st skill. If you don't mind, uh, sure, we'll help you investigate. Excellent! It seems that the Lake of Rage's Magikarps are being forced to evolve. A mysterious radio broadcast is coming from Mahogany, blah blah blah, okay. So we'll just- we just gotta go to Mahogany Town again, okay, okay. Let me just, uh, oh, what?! Uh, okay, hi, Raikou! Hi there! I know you're just gonna run immediately, but... Okay. That's hilarious. <laughs> like, I didn't realize they were right here, I was just like, oh man, okay, I wonder what's gonna happen now. And I don't know, I just hear the theme and it's like, oh, what? Like, what just happened? Plus, I had a repel up, so I was just like, wait, what? <laughs> like, if I have a repel up, I shouldn't be getting encounters! Ah, uh, nice and glitchy, nice and- nice and glitchy, man. And that's the only downside to this, to be honest, the fact that, like, Heart Gold and Soul Silver sprites are so, like, glitchy sometimes. Oh, uh, what's going on here? Dragonite Hyper Beam. Oh, Jesus Christ! <laughs> what took you so long, Luna? Just as I thought, that strange radio signal is coming from here. What do you gotta say, man? The stairs are right here. Luna, we should split up to check this place. I'll go first. Okay. Nice. Alright, let's see. Who do I want to have in the front, though? Actually, let me go to... Let me go to the Pokemon Center real quick, because, you know, I gotta, I gotta make sure my team's doing alright. Even though nothing... Even though we didn't take all too much damage or anything there, gotta still make sure our team is A-OK, -okay, you know? Okay. So let's see. Uh, let's see, let's see. I'm gonna put Mr. Krabs in the front. Mr. Krabs is like one of two that are only level 35, which is Egghead and Mr. Krabs. So let's continue on, I suppose. So, oh boy. I forget how this place works, to be honest. Alright. Okay, so I'm assuming every time we get spotted by one of those, that's just sort of gonna happen or whatever. Luckily, since we're pretty decently leveled compared to everything, we're just gonna sweep through everything, which is great! But at the same time, obviously, somebody might be like, Oh, what the heck, like... Why would you- why would you just over-level or something? And it's just like... To be fair, you do realize prices or whatever, like, his Pokémon are like, his highest level is 34, so... In a sort of sense, I'm not necessarily over-leveling, because... I only level to that point to prepare for Price's uh, gym battle, basically. Like, I could have just stayed at level 30 and we would still be fine, but I wanted to make sure I was ready for the gym battle, you know? Oh boy, so we're just gonna have a bunch of, like, annoying, annoying, like, battles here and there, to be honest. That's all we're really gonna go up against. But at the same time, you never know, it could be useful. Maybe, maybe we do need a couple extra levels here and there, which some of these trainers could potentially give us. I don't know, man. I suppose we'll see. As we continue on along here. Okay, a trainer or two are gonna come by. Tyranitar. Oh, oh god, I need to be more careful. That could have been bad, dude. Uh, Vigoroth. Gotta send in Egghead. Gotta make sure Egghead is decently leveled, you know? Gotta make sure everybody is on par with each, el with each else. That's not how you say that. With each other, I guess. I don't know. Alright, let's just finish you off with a Shadow Punch. Lettyba. Okay. Bit of a weird one, but alright. Discharge Twig, Discharge- oh! Okay, for a second there, I thought- I thought Discharge just didn't affect Tur Twig at all. I was gonna be like, what? What just, what just happened? Got some Lemonade there. Whoa, that was totally worth the fights. 
Alright, let's see. I don't know where we have to go exactly. I think we might have to go this way. But I'm not sure, man, because there are clearly a lot of ways you could go here. So I'm just- I'm very unclear as to where we're really supposed to go. Oh lord, oh lord. How are you not dead? Die already. Vigoroth. Alright, alright. Certainly gotta switch now. Let's be careful. Uh, Spatial Rend. Why not, man? Oh, no. Gotta switch immediately. Alright, Mr. Krabs, go back in, do your job. Uh, what in the world, man? Come on. You should be one-shotting them. What are you doing? Shockwave. Nice and clean one-shot there. Turtwig. Yet again, one-shot. Okay. That got a bit scary there. So let's heal up uh, Egghead here real quick. Super potion. And a potion. May as well heal up Dash as well, right not? Why- Why not? Why not? Okay, uh, let's- let's- let's put Dylan in the front, why not? Let's be careful though, because obviously we got this stupid trainer right here. Oh boy. So I guess as I go through this episode, I may as well talk about stuff. So at the time of recording this, or like, a little bit after I started recording this, um... Nice Articuno. Uh... Pokemon World actually ended. Which is cool, because uh, I didn't watch it all, but I watched a little bit of it, like, basically near the end, and it was pretty cool, I will admit. But the big problem was, no new Pokemon game! I know the time by the time this goes up, it's just not even really gonna matter or whatever, but it's like... It's just like, I was hoping... I know everybody was hoping, honestly, for a brand new, like, announcement or whatever, but... No! Nothing! We, we got actually nothing! Did that just take us? That just took us back here. In the world? That's weird. Okay. Oh, that's probably so we can, like, go heal up real quick or something. Yeah, let me- let me do that! I wanna make sure our team's- Alright, because we're probably nearing- Nearing the end of there? Cause I know it's not, like, a huge, huge place to go through or something. I mean, it is decently sized, but at the same time, it's not, like, a huge area to go through, so... We may as well. Alright, so I went through these tiles. You wanna go this way? Sure, why not, man? You never know what could be over here. I know it's just- I know we're still gonna have to go through a couple Pokemon here and there. But you never know, it could be worth it. Uh, Stone Edge, maybe? Stone Edge again! God, I hate the fact that it's so difficult to find out the typing of some of these Pokemon, to be honest. Cause it's like... You'll try so many moves and even then, still nothing will work. Turtwig. You know, arm. Ladybug, Needle Arm. Uh, you burned us! Luckily, though, do we have any burn heal? Let's check. Uh, no, we don't. Luckily, we have the full heals just in case. You know, we always gotta have those on deck just in case something goes wrong, which it did seem to go. Heal ball that. Oh, no! I didn't mean to go here! Oh, my God. Really? Needle Arm. Oh, my God. Uh, Stone Edge. Not enough. Steel Wing. Not enough. Alright, luckily your whole frenzy plan, plan didn't go too well, because look at you, you had to rest the turn afterwards. Oh my god, I forgot there was another trainer. Nice one shot there, I almost said nice and clean, I need to stop saying that. It's even annoying me at this point. I don't even know where he came from or whatever, but just, I need to stop. Okay. Okay, okay. Let's put somebody else in the front, let's put... Let's put Luke in the front, why not? Alright. So what do we got down here? Oh, hey Lance. How you doing, man? Are you alright? Your Pokemon are hurt and tired. Oh, thank you. I was about to go heal back up. Like, I was about to go all the way back to the Pokemon Center and heal back up, but luckily you did that. Alright, so I know this is like the last area for this. I don't remember what we gotta do though. I should have tried to avoid you, but I'm dumb and don't know how to. Worry Seed, I don't know why I did that to be honest, but uh, Chatter. Did pretty decent in Reno. Oh my god, two one-shots there. Both super effective as well. Not even, not even bad, man. Like, Luke is probably our strongest Pokemon at the moment. I don't know if, like, Luke's stats reflect it or not, but at the moment, Luke has really been doing the most. Let's check out Luke's stats. Luke's highest stat is his health. Which I can very clearly see, because it is... Towers... Well, actually, no, no, no. It basically rivals with Dylan's. Aside from that, attack, like, just pure attack is not even his strongest, like... His strongest stat, aside from that, is special attack, which would ex probably explain why Chatter does so much. 
Hmm, I'm just checking out everybody's stats. Alright. We all have- all of our Pokemon are relatively speedy, which I didn't even realize. Alright, Lance, what's going on here? Lance, in order to unlock the door of the radio transmitter, you need a voice of a certain person. Petro, okay. Hiding in the leader's office. Okay, okay. So we need to get the password. I don't remember how we do so, but we apparently need to get the password. Okay, what do we got up here? And, of course, we got a trainer. I was hoping it'd be something else, like anything but a trainer, but nope. Of course, we gotta deal with the trainers here. Also, it'd be a horrible idea to switch out now because there are obviously toxic spikes. And toxic spikes are the last thing we want to deal with at the moment, you know? We got a person bear. What do we what do we got in there? Oh god, that is Giovanni. I did not expect that. Magnet rise. We could sell it, because it's really not useful for us. Alright, so when we want to fight Giovanni, it's all the way over here. What about down here? I don't know, man. This is... I don't necessarily remember this part all too well of the game. Another TM we could easily, um, not use, but... Blah, 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 blah. Okay. So let's just fight these guys and get the passwords or whatever, I guess, because at the moment, that's that's our objective. We need to get the passwords to unlock the door where Pateral or Peterel, whatever. I don't know how you pronounce that name, to be honest. It's a very odd name. So I guess we'll just see. Oh, God. Keep going for chatter. Zubat, poor Zubat. Oh my god. See what I meant? Luke is like so strong. Now I don't know if it's this guy or the scientist who give us the password, I suppose, but we'll see in a second. The fact that we almost one shot a Charizard there is pretty insane. Password for the boss's door. Radicate Tail. Okay. Uh, let's put Dash in the front. So you got Radicate Tail and what else? Big Root. Ooh, could be nice. Never Melt Ice could be nice. I don't know if I already got the other password or not. Maybe I wasn't just paying attention, blah, blah, blah. Okay, I think it might have been the Rocket Grunt over here. Was it? Slowpoke Tail and Radicate Tail. Okay. Now where do we go? Oh, we probably go back. My bad. Whoops. So let me do that. So back here. Okay. Do, do we just go here? The radio transmitter? Oh, no, 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 no. My bad. Wait, then where do we gotta go? Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Where in the world do we gotta go? Do we gotta go to like... Where, uh, what's his face? Giovanni was over here? Oh, yep. Oh, God, really? Of course you want to pop up out of nowhere. So you're messing with them again. <laughs> you must really like Team Rocket so much. Tell me, who's the guy in the in the cape who used Dragon-type Pokemon? My Pokemon were no match at all. I don't care that I lost. I can beat him by getting stronger Pokemon. It's what he said that bothers me. He told me that I don't love and trust my Pokemon enough. I'm furious that I lost to a bleeding heart like him. Huh. I don't have time for the likes of you. Uh, okay, then why'd you bother coming here anyways? Okay. Ooh, oh my god. Oh, Jesus Christ. Hello. Hello. <laughs> We've been waiting for you, Luna. So... Oh wait, no, we've been waiting for you, so you are Luna. Me? You don't know who I am? It is me, Giovanni, the majestic Giovanni himself. You aren't Giovanni, are you? Wahaha! <laughs> you, aren't, you aren't Giovanni. Huh? I don't sound anything like Giovanni? I don't even look like Giovanni? How come? I worked so hard to mimic him. Yep, I knew it. I'm a Team Rocket executive. You must be trying to sneak into the radio trans, blah, blah, blah. The room is protected with a special password. The really? Nice, nice. Just... Yeah, yeah, just- just tell out the password. Lawrence, okay, that kind of works. Yeah, just say the password and everything while you- while we're here, why don't you? Artist Lawrence. Metagross. Ooh, that could be deadly. I don't know if it is or not, but I guess we'll see! Rolling kick. Not super effective. Oh my god. That was a nice- We even got a flinch. Look at that, look at that, boom. It wasn't even super effective, then we got a flinch, oh my god! Not even bad, honestly. Alright, what do we got next, though? Shellos? Really? Really? Shellos? Come on, I was hoping for a challenge, not a Shellos. Dude, come on. Oh god, that Shellos actually took that hit really well. Spatial Rend! <laughs> nice! Poor thing didn't survive. Tauros. Alright, Tauros might actually be a bit of a problem. I guess we'll see. Alright, Tauros. Hey, you're good. I, I know I am. Thank you. Rolling kick. 
Normal damage. Ah, oh, dang it. String shot. Spatial rend. Oh. He survived a spatial rend. Okay. Alright, so he's a... He's a steel type of sorts. I see that. Hmm. Okay, we got a nice little... Got a nice little kill there with the rolling kick, but that was that was a bit weird because I noticed he was probably a steel type when I used the poison move and it didn't affect him. Since disbanding Team Rocket three year three years ago, our Giovanni has been missing. But we're certain he's waiting for the right time for our arrival. Wahahaha! <laughs> Losing to you won't change the fact that you are unable to get into the radio transmitter room. Need my voice to unlock it. Hey, what's that Murkrow though for? Like, hi Murkrow. Hi Murkrow, how you doing, buddy? How do you money? <laughs> nice. <laughs> yep. I had a feeling that Merc Girl was there for a reason, and it was true. Okay. So let's put somebody else in the front just to make sure that we are going to be A-OK -okay when we go up against uh, whoever. I forget. I forget who we got to go up against, but I guess we'll just see. Wrong place to go. All right, Merc Girl, lead the way. Password is L.J. Vani. <laughs> I love the fact that they did that. I didn't even think... That would be how we get into there. The little guy's just leading us back. He's gonna open the door for us. Nice. Alright. Password is... El Giovanni! Oh my god. Nice! And he just runs away. Nice. Thank you. Thank you very much. Hold it right there! Oh boy. We can't let a brat like you do as you please forever. It'll hurt Team Rocket's pride over and over again. Mimicking... Making... Why did I think it was mimicking? Making it lesson, you see. So it's time to finish you. However strong you may be, if the two of us fight you at the same time, you'll have no chance of winning. Don't you agree? Hehe, <laughs> sorry, baby. Now get ready to be thrashed. That's horrible. <laughs> Hold it, says Lance. Nice. Oh my god. I remember... I I don't know why, but just like Kimberly. Why does that name fit? Come on, I wanted like some out of place name, not Kimberly. But there we go. Oh, mm, that Marowak could be bad to our team. Look at the smile on that man's like. All right, let's be very, very careful. Let's go for that young Rora time. Okay. Could, how, how good is this going to be? Is it going to be super effective? Nope. He's going to one shot. It did not even come close to one shotting. I'm a bit afraid, I will admit. Oh my god. Okay, thank you for taking out that Pokemon. I was scared it was gonna do something horrible. Roserade. Uh, let's see. Let's go for the bubble on... Ro oh, well, it's gonna hit them both anyways, but still. No! Oh my god, no! Are you serious? Right when I thought we were safe. Come on. Ugh. Are you kidding me? I thought we were safe at least for one episode. Turns out that wasn't the case. All right, Mr. Krabs, do some work real quick. Oh my god, thank you. Thank you for cleaning up the field. Instead of Mr. Krabs, I should have named you Janitor or something. Mr. Krabs wanted to learn Nightshade. Nightshade. No. Give up on Nightshade. That was feel. All right, uh, let's just go for a Shadow Punch on the sh on Shfeel. Okay, there we go. Artist Kimberly and Lady Bob are down. Not even bad. I was afraid that battle was going to go horribly. It kind of did, though, the fact that we lost Cry. Anyways, but that's fine. The broadcast experiment was a total success. It doesn't matter what happens to this hideout now. We have much bigger plans. You'll come to appreciate Team Rocket's true power soon enough. Enjoy yourself while you can. Hee hee hee. Alright. I hate you. Sorry, Luna. I saw how well you were doing, so I just hung back. Now all there's left to do is to turn off that odd radio signal. Okay. I guess we'll just do that now. Oh, wait, wait, you have to battle, like, electrodes or something. I think. Hold up, hold up. Okay. Oh god, it's not gonna be electrode, is it? What's it gonna be? Oh god. Um... Die. Well, at least we're gonna be super effective against all of these, so... We're in no trouble. Well, never mind. I thought they were all gonna be Jolteons, but nope. Hi, Electrode. Ditto? <laughs> I just wanted a Ditto, man. We could've gotten a Ditto at the start of the series and I messed it up. Ah! Thanks for reminding me, game. Thank you so much. 
That out signal is finally stopped. The lake should be back to normal. You're the best. Let me thank you on behalf of all of the Pokemon. Oh, yes, you should take this. HMO5. Which one is that one? Whirlpool. Okay. That'll probably be very useful. Blah, blah, blah. Da, 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 da. Okay. I think now we actually just have to get out of here and then we're good. Then we can battle. What's his face? Price, I think. I hope I didn't. I hope I'm not forgetting his name or whatever. But there we go. Perfect. And now this stupid radio thing is done for. What do you got to say, man? What do you got to say? Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Nice. So. Um, I guess with that, I'm going to be ending off today's episode. First off, we gotta put poor Gry in the death box. I know it's quite tragic, but, you know, we kind of got to- we, we have to do it. Oh my god. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, we- we have like, what? Okay, so three, six, seven, eight. We have eight Pokemon in the death box. Oh my god. Luckily, we have some backups, obviously, but at the same time, that doesn't distinguish the fact that we have eight Pokemon in the death box. Oh, come on, man. I don't know. Ah, it sucks. But with that, that's going to be it for today's video. If you have enjoyed, go ahead and drop a like and a comment. Be sure to subscribe if you're really feeling it. And I shall see you guys next time. See ya.